Hydromorphone, trade name Dilaudid, is a medication used for moderate to severe pain. Its therapeutic class is opioid analgesic and its pharmacologic class is opioid agonist. This medication, what it does, it really alters the perception and reaction to pain by binding to opiate receptors in the CNS. And it's significantly stronger than morphine, so like 1.5 milligrams of Dilaudid equivalates to about 10 milligrams of morphine. So it's a medication that we're going to use when our patient is really having a hard time controlling their pain. And we need to keep this in mind as well that we're monitoring how much the patient is getting because the CNS depression that can occur from Dilaudid is going to be that much greater as well. So we really want to assess our BP, our respirations, and our pulse before administration and during and make sure that we're really monitoring how is our patient responding to this medication and is it causing any sort of depression that, that, is, that is too great. We want to help with the pain, but we don't want the patient to go into any sort of CNS depression. Now, with hydromorphone, it's, it's advised that we dilute it with NS prior to administration and that we administer very slowly VIV. So what you would do is you could do like a one-to-one. If you're doing one milligram of Dilaudid, you would draw one milligram of, of NS and one milligram of Dilaudid and then administer that very slowly to our patient to, to avoid and to de- decrease some of this CNS depression that's going to occur. Now, as with all of our opioids, the antidote for this is Narcan. So if we do give it to our patient and all of a sudden we realize, hey, they're not waking up or they're not breathing well or whatever, we would give them Narcan and that that would be the antidote that we're going to have. So what you really want to do when you give patients any of this or you put them on a drip or you put them on a pain pump, you really want to make sure that you have Narcan available. Know where it is, know that you have it and know how to get access to it, okay? Because once a patient's CNS does deplete to the point that you need Narcan, you need it very quickly. It's something you're going to need to get access to very quickly and be able to provide to the patient as quickly as you can. So those are really the basics of Dilaudid. It's an important medication to keep in mind because you are going to give it often um, and you are going to see it quite a bit during your time as a nurse on the floor. This has been another episode of the MedMaster Podcast by NRSNG.com. To get our free cheat sheet covering the 50 most commonly prescribed medications, head over to nrsng.com slash 50 meds. That's nrsng.com slash 50 meds. Thank you so much for joining me today, and thank you for being part of the NRSNG family. We're here to help you succeed in nursing school and in life. So start your journey today over at nrsng.com slash 50 meds. We're glad to have you aboard. You know what time it is now. It's time to go out and be your best self today. Happy nursing, y'all.